Bill is awful tired. So this is how we got this rigged up. Come on, get over here. Come on, out of the way. Bell's are, Bell knows she's already trying to get in there. She's not even gonna give me a chance. Bell, you're, the, ah! you're ah! like a watchdog. Ah! Well, it's a perfect little solo car camp over here at this lake. Guys, welcome back to the channel, Lower Michigan Adventures. And today what we have is a solo car camping next to this lake right here. And uh, so the wife ended up going to work and we decided at the last minute that we would end up coming out here to do some camping tonight. But it's getting awful late. I'm used to getting up kind of early in the morning. So I'm going to walk you around outside the solo car camper, show you wh where we're at. Probably going to hit the sack, keep everything on the down low, and wake up tomorrow morning and set up our uh, hay trip, a tent with awning, and probably do some cooking. But let me take you around out here and show you the lake. I'm going to have to carry my light so you can see, but it's... It's awful late and it's awful dark. Come join us. Come here. Come here. Come on. I just take you with me. Come on. Come on. Get down here. She's awful tired. She's awful tired out. Bill is awful tired. So this is how we got this rigged up. And backlight. Come on, Lou. Come on. Get over here. Come on. Ooh. It's spooky. Lou, it's spooky. is this over here yeah somebody leaving trash I don't know what this is somebody leaving the clothes or something there you gonna get a drink Ooh, kind of cold it's awful cold I'm gonna take you take you back to the car camper and show you what temperature we're dealing with. And the reason why we're not setting up the tent awning tonight is because it's awful cold. I'm gonna wait till tomorrow morning. We're gonna crash out here right directly. Come on, Lou. Bella, come. She's coming. That kid. Ugh. Trying to film in the dark is not easy at all. Ooh, Let's see what temperature it is. And this is the reason why we're not setting up the tent with awning is because I want it to be a little bit warmer inside the car camper. And we may be making some pancakes, coffee, eggs, sausage with the EcoFlow Delta 2. Come on, Lou. We got to get back in the car. My God, Lou. Come here. Come here. Come here, little rascal. Get up there. Ooh. My God, it's cold. People wonder why you don't film at nighttime. It's hard to shoot shots. So we're going to get in the car camper, get the sleeping bag out. Ay, 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 ay. Brr, it's cold. We need to move that sleeping bag over there. Out of the way. God, 
on, Lou. Oh, you want to get in here with Daddy? Oh, it's cold. It's cold. Better turn our headlight off. Oh, nope. Let's set this up here. Whew. And the temperature is just dropping. Now it says it's 34. But we got a nice warm sleeping bag. So once we get in here, Bella's are, Bella knows she's already trying to get in there. She's not even going to give me a chance. Lou, you're not going to give your daddy a chance. See if he wants to warm up. Whew. Gonna six. It's peaceful out here, though. Lou, are you trying to get comfortable? My hands are all cold. Oh, come here. Get Bill inside this sleeping bag. Get in there. Oh, put my head up there. Get in there. Lay down. You going to lay down? <laughs> she don't know where to go. All right, guys. Bella's too hyper. She's trying to find her spot. All right, guys. We'll see you in the morning. Good night, everyone. I slept pretty good last night. Ugh. Let's turn this light on. Oh. Phew. Lou, did you sleep good last night? Come here, baby. Come here, tell daddy. Oh. My goodness. It got chilly, didn't it? Ooh. I had to leave my little battery powered vest on. Ooh. My God, baby. Oh. Yeah, what do you think? Maybe we should get set up. Set our little tent up. It looks like we may have company over there. Oh, they're just turning around. They're turning around. <sighs> oh, shoot. Get out and see who's out here. Show you guys what we got going on. Yeah. 
Ugh. My boots on. Bell out here. Whew. It's a cold, peaceful morning out here solo car camping. And as you can see, we ain't got nobody around currently. There was a car right over there just a few minutes ago. We didn't catch him though. Dude, what are you doing? You're not a cat. My goodness, Bella. You are not a cat. You are a dog. Bella, where are you going? Lou. Hey. Bella, come. Bella, come. Lou, you're not listening. Come on. Come to daddy. Come here. Come here. What are you doing? I think I'm going to get back inside the car camper and let it warm up a little bit before we try to set up the tent. It's cold out here. Mercy, mercy, mercy. Hello. Come. Come on. Come on. Ooh. Come on. Where you at? Come here. Come here. Get in here. It's awful cold. See what temperature it is. I'm gonna start the car camper up and let it warm up. That's it's awful darn chilly in there. I don't know if you can see that or not. Come on, let's get in here. Oh, it's cold. It's cold, it's cold, it's cold. It's cold, it's cold. <sighs> Possible ice. Now it says it's 30. I'm gonna turn on the heat. Lou, are you freezing now? You get out of the sleeping bag, you freeze. Time to make some coffee. Let's get in this puppy. You know your dad's chubby. Make some room for dad to get in, Lou. My goodness. Let's scoot over. Scoot that down there. So, what degree is it in the car camper right now? 69 degrees. So, with that being said, it's getting warm in here. So, I have to take this off. Whew. Get rid of this. Probably need to put my hat back on. There we go. And we need to get our coffee pot down. Oh, yep. Okay. So, put some water in there. Is that a blooper? No, that's not a blooper. Oh, that might be a blooper. 
So filming in a small space can be tricky. Try not to spill water all over yourself. I was going to take this outside the car camper, but I feel like making it, it's still awful cold out. I wonder if I can, is this, you know what? I can actually fill this and then put it up there. So that's what I'm going to do. I think it'll be a little easier. So I'm going to set this back off to the side. I'm learning more and more about this little car camper. Bell's over there being patiently waiting for dad to make some coffee. So I'll set this back up here. And I can actually put the water in here. So let's try this. This cap up here. Set this back over here for now. Put the cap on there. Seems pretty easy. Here we go. Set this off to the side. Cafe. Goes like that. To push the button down. This big cup. This should be an epic cup of coffee at our solo car camping spot. We're here to this lake and it's getting to be a sunny morning out. Uh, is it Folgers? Is it good to the last job? No, it's not Folgers. It's McCafe! Today is McCafe. Although... We do have Folgers, but we're having a cafe today. Well, some morning coffee. McCafe, that is, not Folgers. Right inside the car camper, looking out at this beautiful sunny day. We're here at our local lake. And we're going to set up the little hay trip tent with awning and probably do some cooking out there here right directly. Although it is still pretty cold out. It was a, it was a good sleep last night, but a cold sleep. If that makes any sense. It was a little chilly out. Uh, Bella got us stirred up. When I get hot, I, I pull off the blankets or sleeping bag or whatever. And then I got to realize that we're not at home. And, you know, you're going to get cold because it's a lot colder outside. So it got pretty cold in here. So the plan is I'm not going to make them the way it says to make them. So it's probably going to be an epic fail. But we're going to try to attempt to make some pancakes. And these are S'mores Miss, Mrs. Butterworth Epic Pancakes. It includes the uh, graham crackers and the marshmallow frosting and the chocolate frosting. I'm not going to do all that. We're just going to make some regular old pancakes. I got some sausage. I have some eggs. And... I think we have some uh, syrup, so it should be good. Uh, 
so the coffee's good, but the sun's up. It's starting to warm up a little bit. It's time to get outside this car camper and set up our tent and start doing some cooking. So come on. Come on. Come with me. Not you, Lou. Get back. Belle's trying to come with me, too. Oh, no. She's gone. She's gone. See how beautiful of a sunny day we got? I'm going to have to put my jacket on. It's still cold. It's still cold. And I got all kinds of rocks. I got all kinds of rocks in my shoes. I almost forgot. I got something new for the solo car camper. It's actually for the tent awning. And while we're here, let's put her jacket back on. And let me see if I can find it now. Voila! Now the question is, can I get into it? So what these are, are heavy duty suction cups. And what I bought these for, and I bought them off of Amazon, and I'll probably throw a link in the description. Now, I bought this with my own money, FYI. And I actually got it for the Hay Trip tailgate tent with awning. Instead of uh, tying around my side mirrors over here, I'm going to use suction cups. So, But the tent doesn't come with suction cups, so if you decide to go this route, you're going to have to order some online. So, like I did. set this down over here on the ground out of the way another new thing that I ordered for my hay trip tailgate tent and this I ordered on Amazon too I spent my own money on that and these are I think it says hiker man and these are awning poles. So uh, I think this is just uh, adds a little extra space to the hay trip tent with awning. So this is a good little idea. Like I said, the hay trip tent with awning does not come with these. And I decided to buy some uh, from Amazon. And I'll link this in the description too if you would like to uh, look at this too. So this is the hay trip tent with awning. Now it only comes with uh, the stakes in the tent. So uh, just letting you know. And I think I'm going to put Bella back in the car and I'm going to do this on high speed because I haven't hooked up the suction cups or nothing yet. So I'm going to have to make a few adjustments here. I'm going to put her back in the car real quick while I work on this for a second. So I figured I would set this little hay trip tent with awning up in fast speed so I wouldn't bore you guys. It is a little bit tricky to set up, but I think if I keep practicing over time, I'll get a lot better. And I think that these new suction cups will be a great improvement allowing me to open up my side doors which i believe will actually help with the overall functionality of the solo car camper and overall i think i'm getting better what do you guys think so 
Now for the awning poles, which are sold separately on Amazon, and I bought them with my own money. Uh, that actually went up pretty quick. Uh, I'm getting better as we go, guys. I'm getting better as we go. Well, now to set up the awning. That can be slightly tricky if you have a lot of wind. As you can see, I'm struggling a little bit, but I'm starting to get ahead of it. But that wind can be definitely challenging for sure. Look at that. Look at it go. Oh, my God. Am I going to lose the tent? I hope not. Jeez, oh, Pete's. Wow. And if it was raining, I think I would pull it over just a little bit more. But it's not raining, so I'm just going to show you basically how I would set it up like this. And if it was raining, we'd loosen the wheel up a little bit and pull it more down towards the edge so it would actually come over here even farther. But we don't got any rain, so I'm not going to worry about that today. Yeah, you would pull this from the bottom a little bit more over. Maybe I should do it just for the sake of it. I think we're going to be all right. Just like that. And then to lift them up, I see that they're a little tricky. So right there. Bam, you're good. Actually try to loosen this up, bring this up a little bit more. A little higher, that way we could pull it over more. Over this top. And then I would have to actually loosen this up just a hair. To bring it back to where we could pull it over more. Just gonna pull it over more first, I think, what we're gonna do. Like this. Probably pull it up right up in here. Flag it down like that. Pull this one over more. Maybe clear up in here. Up in there, like that. So that's down more. See how durable these are. See if we can break one. durable I think once we pull these off a couple times they'll be a little easier See the caps? The caps actually go over the top of it. Like that. Back down. One more over. 
and bam. So that's how you do it. That's how it looks right there. So there it is, all set up. I don't know if I got to pull this up tighter or not. No, it, it's good. I'm not going to worry about it. So bring this out here. Bring the EcoFlow out here. And I'm probably going to want to roll this up. This is the bug net. And it actually fastens right there at the top. So you got to roll it up evenly. side here's the other side yeah. that's a trick and now to move my cook station outside set this right here fire extinguisher you never know nice thing the way I like it now with the suction cups instead of tying it to the side side mirrors is now I can easily open up the door to make adjustments if I need to to be able to get in and out of it. For example, I want to get my coffee pot out. And I got to unhook my uh, cook station because it's strapped in there so it doesn't slide around in the car. So this is where we're going to cook at. I'm tied up to everything. Everything's getting caught. Got wires getting caught. Ugh. Everything's getting caught. Got my extension cord up there. I'm a hot mess. I'm a hot mess over here. There. Perfect. Now you got to look at the inside of the solo car camper to see how much it's cleaned out. So Belt is right there trying to be good. There's actually a dog walking by so I hooked her to the side right there so she can't get out. She's only going to go so far. Power supply up. Going to move this stuff over here that up there now set this up here plug this puppy in plug it in back there Probably gonna move this over here. Grab my cooler real quick. And I think, because my mic on my battery is going down, I may have to switch mics. Turn this on. What I'm thinking about doing first, I think I'm going to move this down here, like that, set this up here for now, put this over here, just like that, it's a little safer setup. 
show you how pretty of a day it turned out to be. It's starting to warm up pretty nice. It's not too bad out here right now. What we got here is some Bob Evans sausage. So pop this open. Throw them in there like that. Put the lid on the pan. Somewhere, we got our spatula right here. Set this back. This way. Look at this. Over here. There we go. Crank this puppy up a little bit. So she cooks a little faster. Take you around our little setup real quick. While the sausage is cooking. As you can see they're still holding out pretty good up on top of the car. It's a beautiful day. We got some people out here now. So see how the suction cups are still holding on pretty good. Bella's, I got her fastened over here so she can't take off because there's something going on over here. I don't know what they're doing. Looks like they're cleaning up the park. I should send them over this way because there's some trash over here. There's a trash bag so they could clean this up or I will before we leave. I'm going to try to utilize some of the heat that's inside that pan while the sausage is cooking because the sausage is pretty close. So, this here pocket knife. I'm only going to try to make one pancake and hopefully I don't fail. And this is the pancakes we're going to make right here. I got a couple eggs and I don't know if I'm going to use them or not. Maybe, maybe not. Put that down here. This pancake mix, you just add water and, and stir. I don't want a big pancake. And I don't want to make a big mess, which I did. Set this off to the side. Put a little bit of water in there. Of course, I probably put too much in there. I need an egg just to make it thicker, hold the pancake together good. A little bit thicker. I want it a little thicker. A little bit more powder. Pancake mix, that is. Powder. A little bit more pancake mix. Ooh. That's going to be real thick. Oh, look at my pancake. Now try not to overdo it on the water. I need the wife out here to cook. All right. Let's see what we got here. Ta -da. We 
What do you think about that? Now, if this turns out, I will be pretty darn happy. I'm thinking about taking a couple of these out. Ow, hot, hot. Should use my extra fork, shouldn't I? See if they're done. Done. Put the lid back on it for a second. Not bad, not bad. There we go. I'm gonna have to get those sausages off though. I can run the Where's my fork? Get them sausages and the pancake off. Looks like we're we're probably all done. Does this look like too much food? Depends on how you like your egg. And I want mine done, so look at that pancake. Won't drop it, Jimmy. We've gotta get in here and get the syrup. Hey, we're trying to have this meal in peace. Oh, you're, you're okay. That's just a bird. Better shut this puppy down. Shut this puppy down. Shut this puppy down. So, we made a really good meal, we had coffee, and we're down to 50%. So, I mean, you got to look at this meal and think, is it worth it? Oh, yeah. Mrs. Buttersworth. Let's 
see what we got here. If I can even open it. Don't get old, it's a trap. I tell people that all the time. I can't even open it. I'm gonna have to do it the old fashioned way. I brought butter in case I wanted some butter on there, but I don't know. I don't know that it's needed. See, and since Bell is right over here, Lou, you gotta go over here. Come here. Get over here on this side. Come over here. Well, it's a perfect little solo car camp over here at this lake. But now we're not so solo because there's all kinds of people over there doing some cleaning. And that was a cold night, but not bad. We slept actually pretty good other than Bella got worked up once. No, oh, we slept good. Mm. The pancake turned out delicious. The sausage is good. Yeah, I got my little bowl. So I'm not going to eat all the sausage, so I'll be taking some home. I actually got a birthday party to go to in a little bit, so. Mm. Guys, if you like crazy car camping videos, check out my public playlist where we got all kinds of crazy car camping. And if you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. Pretty soon the wife will be out car camping with us. We got some crazy plans or tent camping. You want it? She's being finicky. Uh huh. Lou, you're being finicky. And your mom's gonna have to clean your eyes. You got gunk in your eyes again. I think you got allergies, just like your mom. You do. My God, look at you. You just go home and go nine nights. You didn't sleep as good as daddy? My God, Lou. You was being the guard dog all night long. We got to get you home and get you your eyes cleaned up. You just had a rough night, but daddy slept like a log. Like a log. Aw, Bill. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this crazy little solo car camping next to a lake. I enjoyed it myself. Thank you for watching. Until next time, my friends, cut.